Hi, this is Chris Gould with Geeks On Tour, and I know how annoyed you all get when you look at your Google Photos library and you see a bunch of duplicates. You know, they're not actually duplicates, right? I mean, you did take 10 pictures of that pretty sunset, but once you've identified your best one, how can you easily delete all the rest so they're not taking up storage space? Let me show you stacks. I'm going to take three pictures of this little android guy. One, and two, and three. Yeah, how about four for good measure? So here's what it looks like after I've taken those pictures. On my phone, I see one, two, three, four pictures of that little android guy. Now, I also took three pictures of this glass, three pictures of Jim, and three pictures of the android guy in a different way. That was over a half hour ago, however, and see how they have been stacked. So if I tap on Jim, I will see all three pictures but there is one that has been identified as the top pick. I don't know. You can decide which one you want to be the top pick. You tap the three dots and set as top pick. So that's, that's how that works. It only takes up one photo square in your library but there are actually three photos there. So there are three photos taking up space in your Google Photos account. So if I say, I only want to keep one, mm -hmm. you tap on this. And if you swipe up, I can tap on keep this and delete the rest. So once I do that, allow photos to move two photos to the trash. Allow. Now... There is no longer a stack. You don't see those little, that little two squares up there. You only see the one photo. Now, how did this happen? Well, when you are looking at your all photos, your photo library, your grid, you should see a three dots. And here is the stack similar photos. If I turn that off, and go back to the library, you will see that I have three pictures of the glass and three pictures of the little Android guy. I tap the three dots, stack similar photos, and now you only see the one of the glass and the one of the Android, but the little two squares in the three. Now, if that looks familiar to you, it's because this is the same process that has always been in existence for burst photos. I take a burst shot by swiping down. Notice I got 15 shots there. So here's what the burst shot looks like. Notice that the icon is a little bit different from the stacks, but it works pretty much the same. You can open it up. You can swipe up and keep this and delete the rest. I don't want to. But And here's another difference. If I go to my settings, oh, and you can get to that by settings also, by the way. Photo settings, preferences, stack similar photos, and I can turn it off. Now, the, uh, the stacks have opened up, but the burst has not. I'm going to put those back on. These are the four I took before, and if I stack similar photos, notice it stacks three of them, but leaves one. I... I can't explain that. It thought that this one was different enough that it didn't belong in the stack. So that's how stacks works. Maybe someday they'll give us a way to filter so that we see only our stacks. Then we can seriously clean up.